I, um, by accident, when I was wash brushing my teeth, I uh, used a water bottle that Sarah had put oil of oregano in, and um, only people who know what oil of oregano are are going to laugh because they can imagine the horrifying pain that I endured. And I just kept thinking, drink more water, flush whatever it is that's on your face off. But then I just kept putting more of it on my face because I didn't realize the oil of oregano was in the water. And um, it's basically like a holistic method of getting rid of a cold. And it's probably one of the grossest things on earth. And it basically burns the living shit out of whatever it touches. And um, all day my lips have been turning redder and cracking. And uh, but I was kind of drunk, and so I. I thought that I had been poisoned. Um, in fact, I actually accused someone in our organization of trying to poison me. I thought someone had snuck in and put like cayenne pepper on my toothbrush as a joke. So all night I tossed and turned and I had this knot of anxiety inside of me and I was like, I will catch the person who did this to me. I will catch the person who this, that did this to me and then I will fucking kill them. And I tossed and I turned and I licked my lips and I drank water, not the same water, but different water. When I woke up this morning, I found out that I had just drank from the same bottle that Sarah had put oil of oregano in and I felt such relief to know that I was not being slowly driven crazy and then killed. Seriously. The story, you may wonder why I'm telling you, is sort of like a... Um, metaphor for love. <laughs> yeah. How? Oh. Because you're brushing your teeth, you're doing something natural and good. Kind of like love. But then before you know it, it's what all of your face it burns the shit out of you. sorry for yourself and you think you're the only person on the planet who's ever fucking fallen in love and ever had their heart broken and you're like, oh my god, I'm so sad, I'm the only one. And then all your friends try to console you and tell you that that's happened to them too, but inside you're like, not like this. My love is special. My love is special. My love is different than yours and stronger than yours. It's memorable in a way yours will never be. We don't tell each other that. We sit across from the coffee shop or at the movie or on the phone and we just say, yeah, I bet you do know how I feel. But inside of like, no, I'm alone. <laughs> Only people who are lucky like me who have endured the kind of love that I have can understand truly how amazing my love is. But I'll pretend like you know just to make myself feel a little bit better. That's what this one's about.